Hello and welcome to the Pope Noob and welcome to the Return to Bloody Nights uh, FNAF fan game demo that came out about roughly two months ago that looked really cool so I decided to play it and here we are so we have a bunch of modes that we won't be able to access because it's a demo but we can access our days of the week so let's start a new game we put it to the settings first what's going on Resync, resolution, blah blah blah, lovely. Uh, updates. Where am I looking at? Okay, let's check out check out the game. Pretty cool. All right. Without further ado, let's start a new game on Monday. So this is the return to Blind Nights. Hello. Oh. It's a phone guy. Oh well. Hello, Henry. Oh. Why are you calling so late now? Is Harry and William? My bear. We have already discussed this more than once. If you mm. knew what I told you, then no one will know about it. Trust it's got to be William. Everything He's British. <laughs> you know well what will happen if we get caught anyway. Yes, but if you stop being nervous and just stay silent at least, the chances that we will be suspected will disappear. Oh. Okay. Now go to sleep. Tomorrow everything should go smoothly. Tomorrow is another day. And I'll do mine. The main thing is not to behave strangely, as I said, and then no one will know about our activities here. Oh. Suspicious behaviors. Oh, I knew it was William. He's British after all. Monday. So I presume the, the plot here is that Henry has helped William commit mass child murder. Hey, Who's William Afton? It's me, Karen. He says. There's a door. So I Not a door. What does that do? It's a flashlight. Oh god. The last due to some recent incident, the management demanded a guard for the night shift. I know you've been hired as a costume briefing assistant, but trust me, out of all the other staff, only you can handle this position. Oh lovely. The salary will be good, no doubt. Also, if you can finish this week without any problems, then you'll also be given a voucher for some free pizzas. Oh lovely. I miss some pizzas. You right away that if there are violations of the rules, your salary may be lowered or you may even be fired. So please listen to what I tell you, okay? Oh, tragic. The most important thing in your job is that you do not allow any damage to the equipment or other properties of the pizzeria. So I would advise you to. What do I hear? Music box. Only resort to extreme measures if you notice someone or something breaking into the pizzeria from the outside. I see, I see. No such instances, but just in case, then we want you to. Cool. I want to note that the cameras record everything that happens in case something does not go according to plan. Now let's talk about the office and your personal safety. In front of you, there is a video surveillance system on which you can observe everything in the building. Cool, cool, cool. mechanical doors on the east and west sides that you can close in case of an emergency or... Oh yes, I forgot to remind you. Our bosses value and take care of all the equipment very much, but especially the pizzeria mascots in the form of animatronics. Oh, lovely. Our engineers don't really have an explanation for this. Of course they don't. Apologies, I'm not talking. I do want to listen to this camera. Camera call. So they go and try to find where people are. Now they're allowed okay. noise or so Head towards. Oh, lovely. So this is a bit for NAF 2. NAF 2 will be right hole. There we are. But the box behind me. <laughs> what is this? Do not want you to touch them, and therefore it's just better to be aware of the 
fire of them and close the doors at the right time. Fair enough. This should scare off the mascots a little, and then hopefully, if you get lucky, they'll just wander off in the opposite direction. Lovely. We haven't tested this out, so you'll be the first one trying this method. Of course so I am. I would be talking to you, but I gotta go. Remember my advice? With the box. Where is Barney going? Barney. Barney, where'd you go? Bye. Oh, okay, let's move off stage. Okay, there's a phone call done, so I can actually talk. Seems this is not active as of right now, so we're good there. Hello? Oh my god, he moves on camera. Oh, that's cool. But yes, this fan game is a bit old, but it's hard to play anyway, because we're not. I'm going to show him here of playing old fan games. Cough, cough, teal land, cough, cough. Um. But yeah, so it seems to be this is... Okay, I can hear sound effects, but... I presume this is the only two animatronics we're worrying about. Okay, Bonnie has gone. Imagine if he gets to the left, so he's coming in there. I don't know what the... Like, the whirring sounds are, and the clicking sounds. I'm not sure. Not... I do not know, but I'm pretty sure. Okay, it's just it doesn't seem to be too active, which is good. Time seems to be going relatively slowly. Bonnie is gone. There you are. He's gone to the restrooms. Okay. Oh, check the box behind us. Something's going to come out of there. Not sure what at the moment. Okay, where's Bonnie? There he is, okay. So I assume once he disappears from there, I want to close that door, I'm assuming. Fredbear still hasn't moved. I think it's Fredbear. Pretty sure it's Fredbear. We'll call him Fredbear for good measure. As soon as Spring Body disappears, I'm going to close that door. It's been for. Okay, it's, I'm going to say it's been 4 a.m. for a long while, but no, it just rolled, rolled over to 4 a.m., so we're good. Music box sounds familiar. I think it's from FNAF 3. I don't know what I'm supposed to close the door now or wait for somebody to move in. I think I wait. Because I think that's the that's the door there. The bottom. Once he moves from the right hall. I don't want to close the door. I am a bit terrified that I'm not it's not I'm not doing it right. Come on, Bonnie. Come on, Bonnie. He's just sort of standing there. The camera gets more glitchy as we stand out longer. The camera's getting more glitchy in general. There we are. Okay, so there was a. F so it seemed to be when we um, we actually went off the cameras. That was that was odd. It took a while for him to. I don't know whether that was just good timing or not. Bonnie was just really polite. Might be the latter, might be the former. We don't know. But it's five a.m. now, which is good. I always love a good five a.m. I am. Let's see how the next night goes, but we should be good for now. I think. I don't think. Spring Bonnie might make the rounds again before we complete the night. So there's us. There's Henry and William in the corner there. We've got the Ashley bubble. It's amazing. I love that. There's those peak game design right there. This is what every fan game needs bobbleheads. Okay, Spring Bonnie's actually moved, so I better actually pay attention now. He is staying there menacingly here. 
It's 27th of June, I think, if I'm asked right. January, February, March, April, May, June, July. Yeah, July. Wait, no, 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 it is June. January, February, March, April, May, June. It is June. 27th of June. Wait, is that when the... Now, if I remember correctly, I swear that's when the newspaper for the missing children incident says takes place. Like in FNAF 1, it's like the newspaper clippings are like, oh, the missing children incident took place on this date. And it's like the 27th of June. So I'm presuming... Hey, there we are. 6 a.m. Bow, 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 bow. It's been a while since I've had that chime. That thick old. Oh. Oh god. I did not expect this. Like a paranormal. Like a paranormal investigating thing? And that's that's the Monday done. I guess we continue on with Tuesday then. See how we see how we go. Not a phone call. Hey, William. William. Hey, Henry. Listen, I'm British. I can't handle this I, wait, I think what? I can't help you anymore with your actions. I won't help you kill what? numerous children. Oh no. William's getting divorced. Well, William is getting divorced. So sad. Oh boy. Don't, t don't say that, Henry. Because Will is totally a trustworthy guy. This is so sad. Oh. I would not help you slaughter children. You remember that we also had to continue building those new robots, right? I need you for that work. You're a master of that type of engineering. Okay. From this moment forward, it's up to you, William. I Damn. all that you needed from me. I believe you can finish the rest of the work on your own. You are a coward. You know that. <laughs> You're a coward for not helping me kill children. <laughs> Oh no. Boo hoo. Don't do This will not be easy for you to leave. This is damn bro. You will know what I mean. The repressed Henry's daughter. She shall be missed. Tuesday. Lovely. Alright. Listen to phone call, phone call. Hey, oh, yeah. fun girl. Hi. What's up? It's Karen here again. Oh, Karen. The second night. Well done. There were no physical breakdowns and everything was in its point. Cool. I still believe that by the end of the week, you will be able to finish your shift without any problem. Lovely. Unless, of course, <laughs> uh, some vandal or thief breaks in, but that probably oh. won't happen. Well, now you're jinxing it. Have any of the animatronic characters started to move? Yes. I wasn't able to watch the recorded camera feed today, you but... Wasn't. Is it the whole? Why aren't we reporting anything? Uh, Why aren't we reporting anything? Looks absolutely dapper, I think. By the way, I had a hand in the 
design of this uniform, and I'm super proud of it. You should be. I'm sure it looks. Oh, so she's the day guard. Okay, so are we William? Because she's the boss here. Lovely. Then eighty-seven. What's on the dates? That's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing, Karen. That's what I'm doing. Uh, what if we're not either? Are we just. Oh, well, it's a difficult completion. Oh, oh that's a goal. From, um, FNAF 6. What, 1979? Oh, I thought that was going to work. Showing some lore. We could use to protect. Who is the most of code I'm missing? Fredbear. Wow. Okay, no, no one has moved yet. They're very... It's like 9,180... 9,171. Tragic. Should make a fox. That's never been done before. Damn. It was bad. The best for bear. I don't know. It's something that Mr. Afton doesn't want to allow. Mr. Afton do some trolling. Like this puppet is gonna show up here, maybe? Why is there a Thanks, Karen. What if I don't remember my seat? Can I bolt out the door? Will do, Karen. Aww. Thanks, Karen. You're a legend. Ten out of ten, Karen. You're great. So let's click on these. Making an achievement for doing it a hundred times in one night at its own. Since the puppet's not bothering us, and we've got nothing else to do, might as well. Um, but yeah, so it seems the keypad does react, but I don't think you can actually enter anything. There is a puppet, there's a, this is clearly a prize corner, and it's definitely a puppet box. So it seems to be some sort of, I presume that's going to be the new animatronic on night three. And the readme, the readme that comes with the game does say that the difficulty ramps, the night three is very difficult. Which either means that these guys get super aggressive, or the puppet is extremely annoying to deal with. But so far it doesn't seem that awful. But I don't know if I'm going to get all three nights in one video, so I'm going to have to put it to one. I think the game's supposed to come out sometime this year? I think? Maybe? Okay, Fre oh, Fredbear's actually moved. That's pretty cool. Pretty neat on. Okay, yeah, so that's just. So, Fairbear's active this night. So, I'm presuming the puppet's gonna be, um. active the next night. Possibly. I thought the code would be 1979 or something. But yeah, this is different completion is a FNAF 6 reference. Took forever to me to realize that. Okay, Swing Bodies in Central Hall. I'm just spam clicking these. <laughs> So I'll just watch Central Hall first. Activate these bubble heads. Make sure there's no puppet. I presume... Maybe the puppet's... Oh, he's waving. And you've moved. Maybe you want to... You want to do the restrooms. Okay, we're just going to keep an eye on the hallway. Just keep an eye on the restrooms. 
check cameras regularly. It's 4 a.m. To add a red bubble head more. Central hall. Hey, so you're in the central hall. Watch here. Spring Bonnie should show up in the right hall soon. You move closer. Spring Bonnie's now moved here. Yeah, he's in the far distance. And you're there, so you're both, you're both far away. So we're going to wait for them to move close, and then we close it all. Because it's still there's still the, the far hall. Okay, Spring Bonnie moved in. Did Fredbear? Fredbear's. He's not actually moving. to do that but he's not actually allowing the generator to cool back down so I am I am forced to uh there we are Twin is already there okay Okay, so you can actually you can hear them moving. Which means the the warning from the to be a lot more aggressive on the fifth night. Not fifth night, second night, fifth hour, who'd say. We're just, we're just doing some bubble heads here and there. Check the cameras. Fredbear's there. Spring Bonnie's there. There we are. 6 a.m., baby. That's pretty solid. Pretty, pretty, pretty chill. Well, there's our 6 a.m. So I get pretty. Now we're paranormal investigating Spring Bonnie. Is this us? And that's like a ghost detector thing, isn't it? The phone? So. Uh, Zoinks, there's a ghost scoob. I'm assuming. I thought there was a. Doesn't seem to be anything actively. That's it. There's the mini game. So next we unlock Wednesday, but for now, that's gonna be it. So I thank you guys so much for watching. And then like and subscribe if you feel like it. And, uh, yeah. Be sure to check out the game, it's really cool. Show our achievements. We get the. We did not get the achievements, this is so sad. Um, but yeah. I'm, uh, I've lost my train of thought, goddamn achievements. Uh, yeah. Thanks for checking it out. I hope you enjoyed this blast from the not so far past. I guess. Yeah. That, that works. But yeah. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.